I'll just open it up. Ooh, ready? Hi friends, welcome. We are two sisters trying stuff. I'm Sarah. I'm Jessica. Today we have yet another British candy box. Woohoo! I do think this one is actually, they have like two different ones to choose from. And I think, I thought this one was like the British snack box, but I, I don't know. So if you have not seen our other, our other British candy box video, we'll, we'll link put it. a link somewhere <laughs> in this video. Um, these come from formerly in the kitchen with Kate is now this with them. So Kate and her brother Alex make up these awesome boxes and they have a subscription. And so we got a new one. We're excited to try. Which has snacks in it. This may be the end of our subscription boxes for a little bit. We had to yeah. take a break because we had too many. We've had a lot. <laughs> I would love if there was like a subscription box service for like the different states. Uh, Wouldn't that be fun? That. Should we start that? <laughs> I was thinking the other day that I would like to do a uh, cooking challenge where we do a signature dish from each state. Ooh. Like what that state is. So we could get people, for. we could do like polls on our yeah. um, Instagram. Anyway. Okay. So we're excited to go through this new box from British Candy Box. Thanks, Kate and Alex. Yes. I love that you guys sign your little I know, pieces of paper you so put in there. It's cute. So we have, I do know they follow us, so. Five, six, seven, Ooh. eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 different things. And there's not a lot of chocolate. I was going to say. You know what's funny? I was looking at that and I was like, I wonder if they took Sarah's suggestion and put Seriously, in some different things. That last box had so much chocolate in it. <laughs> I was dying. Um, oh, I'm excited about all of these. Should we? I want to start with a savory. Start with savory? Yeah. Right. I'm gonna, just going to pick this. Just pick a random oh, thing. Oh, I'll do close-up videos with my phone. I'm well. going to set this box to the side. These are the Real McCoy's Ridge Cut Sizzling King Prawn Crisps. I'm excited about these because we mm -hmm. like those prawn crisps. Oh my gosh, crisps. Yeah. The prawn cocktail ones. Yeah. Here's what they look like in the bag. Oh, they smell good. Yes. Ooh, smell like ketchup. I'm so excited about these. Mm -hmm. Nice and feels like Ridgy. ruffles. Love. Already love them. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. -hmm. These are tasty. Oh. They definitely have more of a fishy taste than those other ones do. You but taste not, fish? But not crazy. Hmm. I don't get that taste. These are just really good. Mm-hmm. Anyway. These are so good. How are we supposed to They're stop really eating They're really thick these? and crunchy. Mm hmm They have a good potato flavor. I taste mostly like cocktail sauce or like ketchup. Yeah, but they definitely have like some other kind of flavor, like a fishy flavor. Not extreme, but. So what would you rate these? Mm, maybe like a three out of five. Oh, I was gonna give them like a four and a half. I really love these. I like ruffled potato chips, and I also just love the name. I've never seen these before. The real McCoy. The real McCoy. Apparently, you can win ten pounds. <laughs> ten thousand. Ten thousand pounds. pounds. If you find the golden crisp inside. <gasps> Did we find a golden crisp? Wouldn't that be hilarious? <laughs> I don't see a golden crisp. Well, we have to split it with Kate and Alex if we found them out of there. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> I think they'd appreciate that. Well, we really like those. All right. Oh, you're just gonna do This is a Cadbury Crunchy. Let me get a close up. Get that Friday feeling with Crunchy. Cadbury Crunchy. It's only 55p. That's cheap. Mm hmm. It's very light. Ooh, golden honeycomb wrapped in Cadbury milk chocolate. Yeah. I think I've had this before. I like honeycomb. Me too. 
Got a little melty. <laughs> not sh not as bad as some of the other ones. Oh yeah, look at that. You can see the honeycomb. Mm -hmm. It's just basically honeycomb dipped in chocolate. Awesome. Yep. I can't wait to try that. Oh, good, perfect. Good little piece. I wish we had a dink it thing. <laughs> we should just say chairs. Mmm. Mm -hmm. I like it. It's sweet. It was very sweet. Mm -hmm. I taste mostly chocolate. Mm -hmm. The honeycomb's really light. It has an appropriate name. <laughs> crunchy. Mm -hmm. It's very crunchy. It's okay. Mm -hmm. I think I'd give it like a 2 out of 5. I give it a 3 out of 5. I like it a lot. I've actually had... I want to say I've had this before. Maybe I got it at Jungle Gyms. I've had something similar to it. Like I've tried something similar to it. You definitely have to be in the mood for something sweet to eat. Oh yeah, it. but it's I sweet. I like it. I like the it's like a light. It's different. <laughs> That's probably one of my favorite things about it is that it's different. Yeah. Ooh, Are I like these. <laughs> oh, that was just recording the whole time. These are black currant flavored chewits. I like that little dinosaur dude mm -hmm. on there. He's cute. <laughs> I think I've had these before. Pretty positive. Really? Right yeah. Either like at Jungle, probably at Jungle Gyms. I don't think I had. I don't remember trying any candy when we were in the UK and Scotland. I tried a couple things. They kind of look like a, a Starburst. Starburst. Yeah. Actually, it reminded me of Now and Later. Is that what they're called? Those Now and Later? I don't know why. Yeah, maybe. But they're the size of a Starburst. I think we had these in a box. I don't know. The wrapper has that little... Drag is, is he a dragon? A dragon? I think he's a dragon. Oh, that would probably make more sense. They're really soft. Cheers. Cheers. Mm-mm. Not so soft. I like the black currant flavor. Mm-hmm. I wish we had that flavor here. They're hard like a now and later. Mm-hmm. For they're sure. They're chewy or like a now and later. Yeah. Um... But they're the size of Starburst. Mm -hmm. And that black currant flavor is very subtle. It's not super strong. I think I'd give these like a 4 out of 5. I and really you really love those, them. don't you? Mm -hmm. I'd give them a 3 out of 5. I liked them a lot. I do like fruity candy. Mm -hmm. I love that flavor. I really wish we had that. What would you compare it to? Kind of like it's grape but better? It's kind of like a mix between grape and blackberry. Oh, yeah. That's a good point. But, but it's a lot more subtle than yeah. those flavors. I, I don't know. I think the thing that we love about British candy is that they don't put a ton of sugar and like citric acid and all that kind of stuff in it. Yeah. So it tastes more like the flavor of the fruit or whatever it is. Yeah. But these are good. I like Chew it. This. I like them. All right, let's go savory. Again. All right, let's do that. I'm interested in these. So these are Twiglets by Jacobs. And they look a little interesting. It says... A whole lot of crunchy in a whole grain munch, right? A whole lot of crunch in a whole grain munch. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Okay. We shall see. It's interesting that they look like Cheetos without any cheese on them. Ooh. <laughs> um, they don't smell nice. Oh, weird. You get a close up video. Here. They smell very whole grain. Ooh. Mm. Here. They're very weird looking. They almost look like little twigs. Mm-hmm. They smell... They smell like cereal. Mmm. <laughs> weird. Nope. 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 Wait. Oh. <laughs> Though... They taste burnt. Mm-hmm. They taste like burnt Cheetos. What a weird thing. It's like they're oven baked, not Ooh. fried. They seriously taste like like if you burned a grilled cheese they or you burnt like your toast. Burnt Cheetos. Mm-mm. Oh, that's so weird. Zero. I give those a zero out of five. <laughs> they're so weird. What is that taste? It's like a... When you first put it in your mouth, you taste like this bitter... Yeah, it's like out of bitter... I don't know. And then it... Ooh! Yeah. 
Oh, I might God. give them a one because I actually think that I could eat some no. of them. It was almost spicy. But I couldn't finish them. That was the strangest thing I've ever tried, I think. These have a lemur on the front. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lemur. <laughs> oh. With fruit on his head. So these are Round Trees Randoms Sours. They look like sour gummies. More sour than a teapot of lemons. Oh, man. I'm yeah. already salivating. Oh, so you don't even like sour stuff. <laughs> I'm excited. Oh, these are fun. These are cute. This one's like a paw. Yeah. This is a bow. Oh, wait, that's a skull. That's a little scary. <laughs> I don't know what that is. It looks like a head. It looks like a mug. A mug? Okay. I have no idea what that is. I like that they're like chewy and then they have like a white, like almost mm -hmm. maybe like a cream bottom. I'm excited to try these. I'm going for the paw. I'll go for this mug or something. Cheers. That tastes like black currant. I like those. They are sour Is it though. Is black currant? I think so. Wow. They're sour. Mm-hmm. Well, the citrus flavors are definitely more sour. Mm-hmm. They remind me of a Sour Patch Kid, Ooh. but not like. They're not as crunchy. Mm -mm. Or crunchy as Ow. hard. Did you just bite your cheek? I might have bit my cheek and it's kind of making my eyes water. <laughs> She's a mess. Bite my cheek and get sour gummy in it. Oh no. Oh, ooh, what would I rate those? I think I would give those a three out of five. I would I like agree the, with you. I like the texture and the mm -hmm. sugar on the outside, but. The, te the texture does remind me of something. Cause it's like. The ooh, it's kind of like the texture of a, um, like a peach ring. Oh yeah. Something like that. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> Next. Um, okay. I, we're going to go with these. All right. For the remix. These are Vimto Remix Chewy and Fizzy Bonbons in mango, strawberry, and pineapple. Interesting. It's kind of all stuck together. They got a little melty. Oh, I should open from the other side. Oh! Ooh. So. Uh oh. There's a puppy coming. So I wonder if they're all like that mixed flavor? I Are think they like so. mango, strawberry, pineapple, you said? Yes. Yeah, they got a little stuck together. That's interesting. I thought they were going to be like different flavors. I thought so too. Oh, they're fizzy and chewy. Cheers. Cheers. Hmm. I don't get fizzy. Oh, wait. Is it fizzing? Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's sour. Those are interesting. These are a little weird. I don't know if I don't like them. They have a, the fizzy part is weird. Like it's, it, they're chewy. Like, um, they remind me of the inside of a Mentos. Yes. And then like they get stuck in your teeth and, but they're fizzing. Like I can feel it, a little bit of fizziness in my teeth. They're like the size of like a gobstopper, I guess. Yeah. I gotta try another one. I didn't like it though. They're di they're different. Mmm. The middle. <gasps> is it? <laughs> I can't help it. The middle is like where the fizziness is because I. Oh, is that? Mm-hmm. I could kind of like got it got it on my tongue that time. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like that weird fizzy powder that was in the the licorice thing that we dipped. It wasn't fizzy though, was it? I don't know. I didn't even try it. Those are interesting. Mm -hmm. I mean. I'd probably give them like a two. Like, they're not horrible. I don't think I'd reach for them. I'd probably give them a two as but, well. I mean, they're kind of fun. If you were a kid, they'd be fun. Yeah. And you know some candies I don't really like. Kids. I don't really like mango and pineapple anyway, so the flavor isn't really great to me, but. 
That's a, definitely a full bag. Yeah. They did not. They're not skimming. Like, <laughs> yeah, it's so full. It's full. It's so fun to try new stuff, though. Mm -hmm. Even though we know we're not going to like everything. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I believe that I have found the black licorice flavored candy. <laughs> These are Blackjack by Barrett. And they are, where is it? Aniseed flavor chews. Mmm. They'll be good for your stomach. They're good for digestion. Oh, why? You don't even have to try it if you don't want to. I'll try it. I mean, it. you know what it's going to taste like, right? Yeah. I'll try it. Take one for the team. <laughs> it's not pig guts or anything, so. Ugh. We're not red and like. They're soft. They're soft on the outside. We'll see what you... You know how, like, sometimes they're soft on the yeah, outside those other when you ones, get to the middle? Yeah, those other ones, the chew were. But this is okay, squishing. I'm just going to take, like, a bite of okay. it. I love black licorice, so. Mmm. <laughs> it's not salty. Mm -mm. I like this. So those get a zero out of five for me. <laughs> I can't. Black licorice is not my jam. These are like sweeter than a normal, like if you eat a black licorice jelly yeah. bean, they have like a sweet taste mm -hmm. to them, not spicy. Like yeah. sometimes they can be spicy. I like these. I'd give them a three out of five because I'm a weirdo, I guess. And she likes black licorice, so. I mean, it's good for your digestion. So if you had this with you, although I'm sure like glucose syrup isn't good. <laughs> that might ruin things so this is galaxy ripple i'm excited to try that what you looking for i'm looking to see if it has anything in it i guess we're gonna just i find don't out. think it does i think galaxy likes to make chocolate bars that are formed different ways because don't do they also make the one with the air bubbles in it yeah, I'm pretty sure this is just chocolate. It's just milk chocolate. I'm okay with that. After we've had a couple. Yeah, the Galaxy bars are good. Mm -hmm. We had one in the last British candy box. I'm not sure if it's supposed to look like this. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of melty. But. Oh. Wait, what's happening in there? Is it like layered? Like ripples. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So when you break it, it's got little ripples inside. That's kind of crazy. Is that why it's called a ripple? But it's also melty, yeah. so who knows how it's really supposed to look. Cheers. Mm. Tastes like milk chocolate. I like it. Mm -hmm. I like that they're making the chocolate bars fun. Mm -hmm. It's good. They have good milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so creamy. I like it. Four out of five. For a milk chocolate bar, yeah, probably four out of five. It's good. Yeah, that one didn't have a lot of excitement to it. I'm no. sorry. I mean, the inside is really cool. Mm-hmm. I mean, I think what they're, I wonder what they're doing is just like making, like you get a whole bar, but because they took like air out of it, then it's, because it says it's only 175 calories for this whole oh, thing. Oh, yeah. So it makes you feel like you're eating a lot more. <laughs> yeah. We're eating something a little better for you. Here we've got, what does it say? Swizzles? Stinger? The cheekiest chew bar on the planet. Tutti Fruity Chew Bar with a fizzy center. They like their fizzy stuff. Mm -hmm. It kind of uh, has the flexibility and uh, the, look of a, <laughs> the look of a Laffy Taffy. A Laffy Taffy. Shake In that Laffy insert Taffy. Insert song here. <laughs> oh. It does it say good. that it's free from artificial colors, so it's oh. kind of like a. Here, let me give a let me do a close up of that. Kind of an interesting color. That's interesting. Yeah, it's like not a really bright green. Yeah, it's not really showing up on camera like it looks in mm -hmm. person. It's a lot lighter. Oh, I'm gonna twist it, but I can't. Mm -mm. Now I've just made. Just take a bite of it. I'm gonna take a bite. Cheers. That's fun. Hmm. I like it. It's fun. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. 
It's got a little bit of like a apple-y. Mm -hmm. I like that a lot. I would take mm -hmm. that over those um, bonbon things. I like this. This is fun. I'd give it a four out of five because it's not sour, but it's fruity. I'd also give it a four out of five because I love things. <laughs> <laughs> we love candy. All right, we're going to go salty again with Walkers. some walkers which we found out the last time is owned by Lay's I put it in the video later do you remember that mm-hmm we do love some walkers chips walkers cheese and onion I like how it says 100% great is it supposed to be 100% great British potatoes I don't know. is that all together <laughs> oh they smell so good Mmm. Cheers. Yum. Mm-hmm. 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 Cheese and onion is one of my favorite flavors of British chips. Those are delicious. I love how crispy they are. Mm-hmm. That's a winner. Five out of five. What'd I give those? Four out of five. Five out of five. Four and a half. Oh gosh. <laughs> I have to think. Do you want to do chocolate? I can, I'm really curious about okay. these. Me too. These are Thor Thornton's Fabulous Fudge in Vanilla Flavor. Mr. Thornton. Mr. Thornton. Who's I hope that? that someone knows what I'm talking about. If you watch... The British series, North and South. Oh. Then you know what I'm talking about. I have watched that, but only once. Oh, oh they're not like... Shoot. I thought they were going to be individually wrapped. They smell so good. Come on. These are like legit little blocks of fudge. Oh my gosh, Caitlin would love this. I just want to try it. Okay. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. I like that. Mm-hmm. I've never known you could buy fudge in a bag. It's way softer than I thought it was gonna be. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna have another one. It's like caramely. Uh-huh. Oh, those are delicious. Mm-hmm. Five out of five. Five out of five. Mm-hmm. 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 Get you some of these. Those are so good. Oh my gosh, these are amazing. One fine 50s morning in the Thornton Sweet Shop, Stanley set out to create a deliciously creamy fudge recipe that he knew everyone would love. Aww. He must have done a great job as it's simply still, as it's still simply fabulous today. <laughs> Some people say the original is often the best, so don't forget to try our original special toffee. Ooh. Those were delicious. There's toffee in here, but it's not that kind. What's next? Let's go for this big boy. Oh. oh that sounds like, like straight up your alley. I'm really excited about this. This is the Cadbury Dairy Milk, the Raspberry Shortcake, milk chocolate studded with raspberry pieces, white crisp pearls and shortcake oh i'm excited about this it says vote to keep me oh is it like a limited only one bar will remain support your favorite at cadburyinventor.com oh so it must be like a special oh, edition kind of yeah. like you get those lace. have you chips? also tried chocolate and simply the zest so it must, <laughs> <laughs> must have orange in it i like that one <laughs> Ooh, y'all. Sarah loves all these things in here. I love fruit with chocolate. It's not very pretty. No, it got melted. <laughs> but it's like that's okay. Sections. Those little raspberry chunks. Mm hmm. And what does it say? White chocolate pearls or something? Mm hmm. Shortcake pieces. There's chocolate. Cheers. Cheers. How do you feel? 
All I taste is chocolate. I got raspberry at the beginning. I mean, it's good. Cadbury milk chocolate is good. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying that's a bad thing. But Let's give it up for the British and their milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. It's so good. It's so smooth. Mm -hmm. It's sweet. I mean, it's sweet like what we have here, but it just tastes better. It's more milk. Uh-huh. Like this is called... Yeah. There's chocolate all over my hand. Ours is just like, here's some super sweet chocolate. Mm -hmm. It's just like sugar. Yeah. I like um, that. I'd give that a three and a half out of five. I'd probably give it a three out of five. I think the more you eat it, the more you get like the raspberry in there. Yeah. But I definitely taste... Mostly chocolate, and then I can taste the little crunchy pieces and just hints of raspberry. Mm -hmm. I like it's good it. though. It's really good. It's good. Now, I probably would like that chocolate though, so. Yeah, <laughs> that sounds really good. We love coffee flavored things. We have two things left. There is a chunky Kit Kat. Oh, I'm excited about that. Let's the just do the top. chunky Kit Kat. I got an inch. Okay. This is the Kit Kat Chunky by Nestle. She chunky. <laughs> is it just like one big fat Kit Kat yeah. bar? I think so, yeah. There's a little puppy dog down here. You know who would eat those weird things is her. Oh yeah, I'm gonna let Chris try them. Those weird naked burnt Cheetos. <laughs> yep, it, it looks like just a big Big Kit Kat. Cheers. Oh. Cheers. This is a Kit Kat. Tastes a little different than our Kit Kat. Mm -hmm. I don't know when the last time was I had a Kit Kat, mm -hmm. to be honest with you. The chocolate tastes a little different. I like it though. I like a Kit Kat. Because they're crunchy, light. Mm -hmm. I gave that a three and a half out of five. She likes my halves. I gotta be extra. I know you do. I'd give it a three out of five. I mean, it's a Kit Kat. But I do love, I do really enjoy of, enjoy of? Enjoy, enjoy the of. breaking of a regular Kit oh, Kat. Oh yeah. Break me off a piece of that. Fancy, Fancy feast. feast. I tried to find that little YouTube clip Break last me time. off a piece of that original toffee. <laughs> this is the uh, original toffee made by Walkers, right? Mm-hmm. Just good ingredients. I like their toffee. Like, it's not crunchy toffee. Whack. Okay. Instructions say, mm. whack, then unwrap and enjoy. I gotta whack it. I'm a little scared. Just against the side. <gasps> scared the dog. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, well I whacked it. <laughs> Did as I was told. Is this the last thing? Yeah. Oh. Does it come like in a little plastic? Yeah. Oh. It's in like a little plastic tray. It looks like there's individual pieces, but it's actually all one big piece, and that's why you have to whack, whack it. it and break it up. Did it break enough? Mm-hmm. Okay. Is it hard? Or is it chewy? I thought, no, it's chewy. Yeah. Mmm. Mm mmm. Mm mmm. I want to break this up. Look, put... it's made whole milk and butter. I want to break this up and put it in some cookies. Oh, it's so good. Oh, got in my hair a little bit. Mmm. Five out of five. Five out of five. I'd much rather have this kind of toffee, the soft. It's more like a caramel, but it has that toffee flavor. It's probably what the chewy Werther's taste like. I've not had them, but... In a few minutes from now, mm -hmm. we'll be done chewing. Mm -hmm. Those are so good because you just need, like, one. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you so much, Kate and Alex. We really enjoyed this British snack box. Yeah. Um, and thank you for excluding some of the chocolate. <laughs> The chocolate is so good, but we we also really love fruity candy, so we loved having some. This box was like the perfect mix. It really was. We had a few savories. We had like like the fudge was different. The yeah. toffee. It was it was like the perfect mixture mm -hmm. of 
chewy candies, chocolate, and savories. We really enjoyed it. I think all in all, we really love your boxes. Mm -hmm. um, it's different. It's some stuff that we've had before because we have been to the UK and we've, like, we have that Jungle Gyms grocery store that has um, food from all over the world. So we like to try different things. But it's, a lot of it is stuff that we've never had before. Yeah, most of this stuff. I was like, I'm not, I've had the toffee before. Mm -hmm. But, like, most of it, I was like, I've never had this. <laughs> yeah. So, we really appreciate the variety that you put in your boxes. Awesome job. Especially um, for us to get two boxes. Yeah. And have Both a bunch of different Both will be different. Things. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's great. But that's it for this episode. Um, make sure to like the video. Make sure to subscribe. Hit that bell for notifications. And comment down below um, if you've tried any of these items. If you're from the UK, is there a certain way you eat any of these things? <laughs> Um, Do you smack your top on the table <laughs> like that? That was pretty fun. Yeah, it's it's a lot of fun. So, um, and... Also, share this video with your friends. Until next time, keep on snacking. Bye. Bye. I like these ones that are like... Uh-oh. Here she goes. <coughs> I like swallowed before I finished chewing that oh and I got gosh. like the tanginess down my throat. Okay. Great work. Hold on. Um. Hold on. <sighs> Carol. Ow, I already bit it. Sorry. I wasn't supposed to hit you. <laughs> Mr. Thornton, vanilla fudge. If you... Hold on, I'm going plug my phone in. This is the Cadbury Dairy Milk. The Raspberry... <sighs> sh Can I use your phone? British TV shows and movies with kids. Mm -hmm. and they're like, here's a toffee. Yeah. They're usually like, have a toffee candy. Usually like individually wrapped. Oh man. Hamburger. 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 Hamburger.